me see that. At last, a mystic talisman. It's time to move out. We got four more talismans to find. You there, fetch my bags. <laughs> Soon, unimaginable power will be mine, mine, mine. <laughs> Welcome back to Pez Plays, everybody. As you saw there, that was uh, Cast Boss Cast the Cassowary, and he found the uh, first uh, Tasmanian Tiger uh, talisman, of which we're trying to find. So now that he has one, that's uh, a bit of an issue. Uh, do I want to go this? Let's go to walk in the park. So yeah, the uh, Rainbow Cliffs, what we were just in, is the main of the levels. And, uh, yeah, you take the portals to places like this. The Wallabies! So cute. Like I was saying last episode, um, you can race the NPCs, and in this one you race, um, some sort of weird bear thing. I don't really know what it is exactly. Uh, through one of those uh, surfing things, the water slides. Alright. And this level's a bit more complex than the last one, but it looks so much cooler. Along with the change of music. I freaking love this game so much. Ah, oh, man. But hey, Shazza, Shazza's Ty's girlfriend. This time, her truck has broken down at the end of the oh, no. road. Hello. And if that isn't bad enough, I spotted some. Yep. Uh, yeah. But the end of this will go help her out. More frills. can't get that thriller thing stuck out of my head, the whole frill thing. Oh, gosh. There we go. Oh, was that another? Oh, no. That's just a sign. That was a cog. Rubber dunny. Where are the giant beetles? I saw a giant beetle. There he is! Look at that thing! He's freaking massive! Ew! So huge. The grossest thing are the leeches. And again, we'll get we'll get to spiders later, and they're pretty bad too. Ooh, real. Okay, hello. Their eyes. Just look at their eyes. They're they're so massive. All right, take care of you. Bite, and off he goes. Bye. Poor thing. Just flip it upside down and knock it over a freaking cliff. Alright. Let's keep going. I want to get those new rings quick. Oh, oh, where's the frill? There we go. Got him. Collect all of the opals. That should really let me know if you want me at 100% it, or whether, um, I should just, like, go through the whole story. Which I've kind of been skipping, really. Um, I skipped the opening cutscene to the entire game, which gave the whole backstory I was trying and failing to explain the last episode. Um, if you want to see that, let me know. It's a whole five-minute animation that gives the backstory, so... I didn't want to just put that there because I didn't want to talk over it as much as I didn't want to, like, have to wait a whole five minutes to actually start the gameplay and stuff. So just let me know if you want to see that, and I'll put it up sometime. Uh, here we go. We get to the water slide. Yes. A few things you need to know. You can bite and duck and jump and... If, if, yeah. Gotta watch out for a little debris like that. And this is the biggest nuisance, trying to get every single opal on these water slides, because there are quite a few of them. <clears throat> also gonna wanna... never mind. Okay, that did not work. 
get it next time. There's like a cavern there we can get into there where I think there's a thunder egg. Pretty sure there is. Oh, see what I mean? Just missed that opal. Oh well, we'll get to that later. The handiest thing is to when you get the uh, magnet on these water slides. Are there any leeches around? Yes, there are. That's a leech. Ugh. You just explode into purple. Oh, hello. Everybody says good day. Hey, Ranger Can, we gotta get the. Okay, I can't skip. Oh, I can skip this. Alright. So, yeah, there are bats in this cave that we gotta. Are you okay? Do you need assistance? Oh! Uh, uh. Are you okay over there? Uh huh. Well then, that's a thing. <laughs> um. I don't know anything about the floating frogs. That's new. Huh. Do you float too? <laughs> I love their animation, it's just like two frames. Of them just... <laughs> oh, they're so cool. I also like how you leave paw prints. In the, uh... Mud. Where are these guys here? Oh, jeez! Oh, man, didn't see you. Gotta knock him over first. There we go. Get an extra life. Alright, where are the bats? The bats, bats, bats. Uh... Where are the bats? I don't see them anywhere. Where the heck are they? They're supposed to be right... Oh, there's an invisible box. There you go. They drop, like, uh, concept art gallery stuff. That's why I'm not really worrying about them. Where the heck are the bats? There you are! I see him. Alright. Uh, gotcha. Yeah, basically we gotta throw a boomerang at the bats to get them outside of the cave before it floods. Which there's really no time limit. We just gotta get them out. It's like a tutorial for the aiming. Alright, they're heading out. Sweet. Just slowly make our way across this mud. Alright, right, they're going the right way. Sweet. Can't go ahead of them or they'll turn back. Because you can only hit them once they're on the ceiling. Should only be one or two more times. Oh, nope, they're out. Sweet. No, they aren't. Get out of here. Woohoo! Yeah! More thunder eggs! Ugh. So gross, all their purple slime. Alright. I'm going to it here today. This one was shorter than the last episode, but... We'll get longer ones later on. Anyways, see you next time on Pez, Pez Plays. Next time, we'll go down this water slide, we'll get all the opals, we'll go on races, we'll help Shaz out with the frills, and yeah. See you next time, everybody.